Howdy y'all, good morning, good afternoon, welcome to the first annual cocktail party. I'm your host, or just announcer for this first part, Duke Garfield. Three contestants will start off. All three of them will be given required alcohol for the first round. They gotta use that required alcohol to make the drink. At the end of that round... Whoever's drink was the worst, or the judges did not deem fit for the next round, they're gone. I'm done talking that accent right now. And for the second round, they will also pick a key ingredient and alcohol of like their choice. And at the end, there will be deemed one winner. And that's it from Duke Minecraft Steve. (laughs) Let's get right into this. All right. I'm very excited for this whole cocktail throwdown. I think it's going to be a really fun night. (laughs) One of my competitors has just attempted to draw first blood. As you can see, he failed. Um, I won't, though. I've had a little bit to drink. That's why I'm fumbling. Um, I'm very excited. I'm feeling a little confident. I'm not cocky. I'm not a very cocky person. I think if you ask anybody in the room, I'd like to think nobody would say Phil Long is cocky. Phil Long is cocky. I'm very excited. This is going to be a great night, and I'm excited to see what I make, and I'm excited to see what my competitors make. There's, I mean, this is a challenge. We really got nothing prepared. Like, I'm, I'm ready to go in, get my, my ingredients, and, and make something good. Uh, whether it be Adam's, Adam's, uh, Adam's beach juice or whatever. Oh, I clearly don't care about these judges. I'm going to poison them. <laughs> Pretty much. Okay. You guys ready? Yeah. Yes. Your secret ingredient is, kept it super simple for the first round, rum. Either silver or gold. Doesn't matter. Okay. That puts a damp room. Who's first? Who's going first? Me. Um, okay. Yeah. All right. Adam, first. You have- round one, fight. We figured out that we are uh, using rum for our secret ingredient. Um, I have decided to make a variant on Adam's main beach. All right, stop so, watching now. I'm going to need orange juice, some pineapple juice, and I'm pretty sure that's it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. I also need this banana boy right here. He's a banana boy. And we're using this wonderful, wonderful lemon cup. There's no lemons in it. Um, so first, let's grab this stuff. Some, oh, that's, there's something in there. Let's, let's take that out. We don't, we don't want the judges to be poisoned. I do. <laughs> Matt. We're putting in a couple little things of pineapple juice here. Maybe we're going to go for another half. We are going to be using Bacardi Light Rum. Um, we're going to go two of these big boys. Also, we're going to be using some, some OJ and like another half. I'm eyeballing this real hard. Now, some creme de banana. Time check. Yeah, uh, seven minutes. Seven minutes? Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> we don't need ten minutes. No. Yeah. If it oh, takes you ten minutes to make a cocktail, you shouldn't be yeah, a bartender. No, you should probably <laughs> it might take me ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to put these bad boys back in the fridge. Just to keep clean. <clears throat> Cleanliness is next to something. I don't remember the phrase. All right, now... Now comes the fun part. Very close. Shake, 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 Sonora. Shake your body, line. Work, 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 Sonora. Shake it all the time. I'm gonna pop this bad boy off. I want you to get in here. Look at that froth. Wow, look at that froth. It's nice and frothy. Now comes the fun part. The pour. There's too much. <laughs> no, it's not. Just enough. Just enough. Yo. True. All right. All right, and that's it for my time. Wait, I'm, I'm very gonna... happy you guys okay. picked rum because I was able to make a variation of Adam's Main Beach. Oh. So you use silver rum. Yes. It looks good. Is it frozen? It's like no. On top. It there's, there's ice in there. All okay, right. It looks as let's if it's margarita. Let's so explain, explain the, the contents. So the contents of it, we got the light rum. We have the banana, banana. liqueur. 
We have uh, pineapple juice and orange juice for a little city. Okay. okay. I feel like no one. Like it. You, you gotta, you gotta keep it secret. <laughs> I can't wait to fuck. I can tell. She didn't want to eat. <laughs> I'm tasting it. I want a second sip. Tom tasted it like he tastes beer. Looks like a beer. It does look like a beer. I definitely only taste banana. I don't. It overpowers <laughs> everything else. <laughs> Alright, who's next? That's me. There's a lot of alcohol in this. Our thing is rum. So we're going really tropical. Right? We're gonna start out with a little bit of pineapple juice. Like a half ounce. Just a tad. We just want a tad in there. Definitely gonna put this in there, the banana stuff. And then, oh no, get the pour in there. <laughs> Bruh. That was about to be bad. Bruh. We're gonna tiny bit of this, probably like a half ounce of this too, is because our main ingredient has to be rum, and we're given two options. We're putting both in. And then we're also gonna put one ounce of the creme de banana. <laughs> I hear this. Super, super tiny bit. What are you doing? Just a <laughs> little bit of that. Okay. In the <laughs> oh. Then we're gonna get back our glass, which we put in the freezer, so it's Ooh. nice and chill. You know, there's ice in here. We don't want like extra little ice chips, so we're gonna double strain it. You guys just had Adam, rum, uh, we're keeping it pretty tropical here. I present to you the tiki room. The tiki room. So that's an orange slice. And it's in there, so I used grenadine uh, syrup for a little bit of cherry. I used, um, what did I use? I used a little bit of like raspberry, like mixer type thing for a bit of raspberry flavoring. I used some pineapple juice. I used the banana liqueur. So we just got a lot of like tropically light fruits mixed with the rum. And then I drizzled a tad bit of the Contrio, um, Contro uh, bitters. Mine's gonna be so good you know. I got it. What's up, boys? Timer set? Yeah. Alright, hold on. Follow me. Oh no. Matthew. Oh no. That one with that deep boy right there? Go. 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 Ryan Reynolds ingenuity right there. Yeah, Ryan Reynolds, bless up. Um, what's this? That's rum, that's, that's what you gotta that's, use. That's pretty low though. So where's the dark one? Right here. Alright, so you want. Oh my god. Yeah. Use so much more gin. <laughs> Yo, we're all three of us are put banana with the corner. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> what did I got? Smell like hold on. Oh, he's putting a lime in. A lime? That's gonna be the only good thing in it. Oh, Boy, Tom said he wanted this. Oh my god! Don't use it all. It's getting worse. <laughs> so no, man. More. What are you More. doing? More. More. Now you can't smell this back. <laughs> Well, you can still do it. <laughs> no, water. I, I can't remember that. Bad. <laughs> we gotta I'm finish it in here. Yeah. It's still bad. It's gonna taste horrible because it's so watered. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, where's the Cheetos? I no. can't do it. I can't bring myself. Wait, where are the Cheetos? Are you, are you actually tasting it? Spicy. 
wait. It touched my lips. <laughs> and it was spicy. Oh, I put them in the hole. Oh, there. Matt, I'm not. Oh, God. <laughs> You fucking right, guys, you ready? Are you ready for this? Yes. You gotta shake vigorously, man. <laughs> oh, wait, we're missing something. Oh, no. 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 <laughs> oh, no, don't waste no. my orange juice. No. We gotta. Is it coming out? Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, the rep. I can't believe I'm letting this happen. Okay. Hold you should have rolled it in there before. Yeah, you had to do that beforehand. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. Alright, you're, you're, you're <laughs> it looks really good. Are you recording? Yeah. Matt, if I smell soy sauce, I'm not drinking it. This is soy sauce, I promise. Alright, it's good. It's what target sauce? There's no target sauce. It's fine. Nothing too crazy. Is there any condiments? No. <laughs> Mayonnaise. No. Okay, Alright, eggs. So, <laughs> I present to you guys, ladies and gentlemen, get the, get the camera here. The poison control. All of it. Because after you drink this, you're probably gonna have to call me. Now, what's in it? Uh, well, I'll explain it as you're drinking it. No, you're gonna explain it now. No, I'm gonna explain it as you drink it. Um, so it is. I don't want to drink this. It's about probably two ounces of. Careful, it doesn't spill. No, you need to drink it first. I think you need to drink it first, drink it first before I explain. Okay, I'm not drinking. No, you need to drink it. <laughs> I need to know what, what's going on. What's in it now or I'm not drinking it? No. Like... That's something weird. I don't want to tell you. Just drink, just drink, just drink. <laughs> there's a tie. Take, no. No, no, there's not a tie. That's why it's poison control. Take a sip. Take a sip. <laughs> <laughs> you got f***ed. You got f***ed. You got f***ed. Oh, oh, there we go. That's the rule. <laughs> I'm not drinking anymore. There's hot sauce in it. No, there is. Oh, there's Old Bay in there, yeah. And red pepper flakes. For I know. <laughs> it's actually not that bad, I'm not gonna lie. Wait, really? So, There's one the pepper ingredient, flakes. which is probably. I eyeballed it, so it's probably about around. That's the We're taking it. Wait, no, no more. We're taking it back into the room. Yeah, There's no more oh. to Okay, it. so. We're gonna give pros and cons, then say who say who we, who we like the best, and it's automatically going on to the next round. And then we're gonna eliminate the first. Adam. Actually not bad. Came out pretty decent. My my note to you would be a little less banana. Okay. A little more orange juice because okay. it feels like it tastes like there's none in there. Okay. Because all I taste is pineapple and yeah. banana. Oh. Pineapple, banana, and rum. That's yeah. all I taste. So my input would, was, is that you do taste the pineapple a lot, so adding that sweetness would kind of bring the tartness down. Okay. Yeah, but it was a little tart. Yes. So for Phil's, we like the fruitiness of it. The fruitiness was good. You put a little bit too much rum. Okay. Like, we, like it was a little too much a little liquor too to where, and, and I think that what did you in, and what I would have done differently if I were you, was not do both rums. I think that you should have just done silver. I think that the the like oakiness and like the like the like gold rum has that distinct like taste because it's like you know it's it's different. That it like the aftertaste kind of like all we got was the gold rum, but it like okay. not in really a good way. I just do think that the rum kind of outshined everything. Okay. Your mixers in, so I feel like if you put a little less rum and a little more of the juice and the orange, like it would have been like spot on. It reminded me of a, like a rum bucket, to be honest. Okay. I like all the mixed like fruits and stuff you got going on. Yeah. But I do think if you focused more on one flavor, either the cherry or the raspberry, okay. it would have come out more like potent gotcha. than one of those, and it would have made it stronger and maybe overpowered the like the alcohol a little bit gotcha. because it was a little. Mats. Okay. I have to say, totally shocked. Actually liked it. <laughs> the cayenne this? pepper finish is actually pretty delightful. People underestimate how great cayenne pepper can be. In like, like, well, well, like, well, like the, the pepper flakes. No, because the pepper, because, because the thing is, is that so when you first take a sip, it's very like 
sweet and like fruity kind of because of the Cointreau and the rum and the, the pineapple juice that you put in and the lime and stuff. It's like kind of sweet. And then you get, and then after you swallow it, you get hit with the pepper flakes and it's like good. Like it's like actually pretty good. Like there's a like, burn to it out of yeah. the aftertaste, but it's not, it's a good burn. Yeah, it's like from a good the, burn. From the pepper. It's kind of like the same, you know how like, you know, have you ever had pizza with hot pepper flakes on it? No. <laughs> okay, well, well, the re- well, well, the reason why you put hot pepper flakes on your pizza is because you get that like kick after you eat the pizza. Yeah. Like it kicks in after, and that's kind of like what we were getting from your cocktail. Mm-hmm. Yes. And so, like my Nicole. only note, my only note would be my note, my main note for you would be it could probably do a little bit less pepper. You said you've dumped in the rest of the thing. Yeah. I think if you dumped in you half of the rest of the thing, like half or a quarter yeah. of the rest of it, it would have been way even better because it would have been more subtle as opposed to like. Like it's a little, it's a little bit too much. Okay. Let me tell you, it probably be a lot worse if I didn't put like a half a cup of water in it. Oh, you put a half a you cup of water? water in it? That's just so strong. Well, the, the, well, the diluting it definitely worked then, because you still get the alcohol, but then did you honestly, taste it that's probably Wait, what saved you. Did you taste it before you gave it to us? No, I did. It was bad. It was bad. It, it was tasted like the water. Thick medicine. Oh my god. Before oh, I put well, water. Well, yeah. Right. Okay, so moving on to the next. Wait, wait, moving on to the next part. It's gonna shock you, but that's our favorite. Yeah. What? Matt's going to the next round. Let's go, baby. Let's go. All right, so Adam, Phil, we enjoyed both of them. We really did. I but only one can move on. This <laughs> next round just kills me. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but we have to let go of Phil. I know it. Uh, yes, I lost. I'm a little disappointed, but I'm disappointed in myself, not with the judges and their tastes. I'm very mad at myself. Uh, there were a lot of flavors in there that I put off the cuff that without really tasting it, I probably, not even probably, I should have tasted my drink before I uh, gave it away because they said it was too heavy handed. I'm excited to see what the other contestants make but I'm even more excited to come back for episode two. Tom. Bam. <laughs> Tissues? <laughs> <laughs> so is that the main ingredient? <coughs> no. This is a required alcohol. Just a required. Oh, yeah. What, is so, there like a special? Are, are you ready? And then, wait, wait for it. Oh, the special ingredient, come on, Chicken is wings. bam. Ginger of ale. Okay. Okay. Round two. Fight. Obviously, the key ingredient. Aviation gin. Oh, we need that. Let's just get the key ingredients out of the way right away. You know, and the ginger of the ale. I thought that was going to explode. Alright. I did not agree with the ginger ale, I can tell you that. No. Oh no no no. They think mine was too heavy for it. Oh no. Oh no. Did you see what you put in there? Yep, chocolate. There's some chocolate. That's probably gonna do nothing to it. <laughs> probably not. No, 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 no. What? I just bought that. Don't use it. Oh. What the f is that? What is it? <laughs> oh my god, I think it's I think I think it's curdling. I think the cream is <laughs> Man, you gotta be careful. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> you still have to shake and put it and pour it. Oh man! It's the, the pressure. Ginger ale, the ginger ale. Is oh ale. yeah! We can't do this with the ginger ale. It looks like a strawberry milkshake. It does. <laughs> You're like an idiot, bad. It tastes like candy. It tastes like what? It tastes like candy. What? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
I call it the Tutti Fruity, give me that booty, all right? <laughs> I'm not trying to tell you tell us in it. All right, I, to be honest, I don't remember. Coffee creamer? Wait, coffee creamer might actually, not be that. I know, that's it so bad. Curling, no. it's so <laughs> Did it actually start curdling? No, it didn't. Okay. okay. Ginger ale. And we're throwing Chateau in. Chateau. Mm. Whiskey. I've seen Phil do this. That's what they do. Yeah. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Alright. I give you ginger and whiskey. Okay. You put whiskey in it, you put bourbon in it. Yes. Yeah. And you put quattro in it? Yes. Yeah. Alright, tell us all the ingredients. Whiskey, ginger ale, <laughs> quattro, <laughs> <and> bourbon. <laughs> uh the states. <clears throat> yeah, so it's bourbon. Yeah. And lemon. So bourbon, Cointreau, <laughs> Why are you so ginger ale, and lemon. Yes. Why are you so Go ahead, Tristan, take the first sip. Came out of the, became mm. from left field with that bourbon. <laughs> the whole night it's been fruity <laughs> tiki yeah. bar. Yeah. And this motherfucker <laughs> came out as with, <laughs> a <laughs> with a yes. great gaffy drink. I feel like I have standards. No, meaning I don't want to kill the person. Ready to go to the break. I'm going to the break. Look me in the eyes, Judge's Cam. <laughs> That's not Judge's Cam. We're sending it. Matt wins. Alright. But I wanted to. We have Pepper in the first round, great choice. Oh. The coffee creamer, that creaminess made it taste like a push pop. Yeah. Don't know how. Our, our, one, our, one, our one con to you. Is what? it's a little light handed, it's pretty weak. If it was maybe in a favorite glass, Matt, underdog, took it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Matt, we Good. really thought you were not. We really didn't think you were going to put us wrong. Whoa. So, congratulations. That was crazy. What are you going to do with this new title? I'm going to Hollywood. <laughs> Set me up. Yeah.